Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's tutorial is going to be on my gel nail manicures. I posted a tutorial how I do my SNS powder nails and everybody loved it. It's actually very popular on my channel and on my Instagram, so I figured why not to do a tutorial how I do my gel nails as well. So if you guys want to see how I create my gel nails, just keep on watching. Before I'm going to start on my tutorial, I'm going to show you guys the collection I received from Red Carpet. And uh, this is their spring collection 2019 and the name of the collection is Brunch on Melrose. So the colors we have is Fluent and Fancy and this is a color or overlay. And this is a very light shimmery like a gold reflect. Then the, the next shade is Material Yellow, and I think this is the color I will be trying today. And the next one is Color Splash and this is a very light uh, pink shade. The next shade is my Walk of Fame and this is a purpley shade. The next one is a gorgeous blue color and this is a Star Truck. And actually my daughter used this a few days ago and the color is absolutely, absolutely stunning. The next one is probably this is one of my favorite shades because I love my pinks and reds. And then the name of this one is Dress the Part. And this is a very pretty like a pink with a little bit of red hue polish. And then they have their new reformulated base coat and top coat. Also, they are formulated right now with vitamin A and biotin to help you protect your nails. And I'm really curious to see how the new formula is. So let's start. On my nails right now, I have a red carpet gel color in white, and I have uh, just a top coat of a glitter nail polish from OPI. I don't remember the name, but if anybody is interested, I will list it down below. So I'm gonna first need to take this nail polish off and then I'm gonna have to buff the gel color. So I'm gonna be using pure acetone. I'm just gonna wipe the nail polish off first. If you ever wanna apply a coat of a nail polish on your powder nails or your gel nails, trick is you have to buff your nail first. Buff it to make it matte. And then you can apply any type of color and it's never gonna cheap and it's gonna stay and it's gonna be unbelievable. I bought from Amazon this set and comes with 10 clips for toes and fingers. I don't use for toes because I don't use gel nail polish on my toes. Comes with five nail filers and then uh, 550 pieces lint-free nail wipes and then one stainless steel triangle cuticle pusher and peeler scraper. Tool is amazing. It's so much easier to remove leftover gel nail polish after soaking it off. I'm gonna use pure acetone and I'm gonna soak this lint-free pad. It's pretty saturated. I'm gonna fold it in half. I'm gonna place it on my finger and I'm gonna clip it stays nice and put and I'm gonna repeat on the rest of my nails now I'm gonna sit about 10 to 15 minutes and I'll be right back now I always get asked how I do on my right hand so I'm gonna show you guys how I do it with my left hand on my right and I am a righty so before I'm gonna take them off I'm gonna tell you a little bit uh, my opinion on these clippers. I do like them that they are very comfortable and very easy to put on to take off. The only issue I have is with this little uh, lint-free material. I don't like it for soaking off the nails because it doesn't work that well. It gets dry really really quick. I did try on uh, two of my fingers the cotton the usual way that I do. I just rip off a little piece of cotton and uh, soak it in acetone. So I'm gonna take this little tool and this tool is absolutely amazing to scrape off any access of the nail polish that left then I'm gonna do it on my thumb I'm gonna take the scraper and you can see how easy the nail polish scrapes off When there's a leftovers a little bit, what I like to do is take a buffer and just buff out all the leftover of the gel that left. And you can see how nice and smooth it is. And then I like to take and reshape my nails a little bit. And then I take a wet paper towel and I just remove all the dust. The nail right now is ready for the application and I'm gonna finish all my nails and I'll be right back. So I already did a few of my nails. First thing first, we're gonna start by cleaning our nails of any residue and if there's any oils or anything left on it with this Purify by Red Carpet. And I'm gonna use on this lint-free cloth and I'm just gonna wipe the nails 
and it also acts as a prep. The first step to the gel nail polish is this LED base coat and we're gonna be using with the red carpet LED lamp. And the trick is to get that perfect gel manicure is to apply a very thin coat. The thicker you're gonna get, the messier it's gonna look. So you have to make sure that you clean the brush really well, apply a very thin coat and you have to be very careful you shouldn't go on your skin or on your cuticles. Just take your time with it. And then I like to do also over the free edge. And then cure. So what I like about this light, it cures for 45 seconds. Regular uh, salon lights usually cure for two minutes. I do have that one as well. But I like this one because it's nice and compact. It's easy to use and it's quick. And it's done. And I'm gonna do my two other fingers. And I'm gonna cure it for 45 seconds. Now for the nail polish part, I'm gonna be using this shade and this is 528 Material Girl. So what I'm gonna do actually, because I already did most of my hands and I just have three fingers, I'm gonna do them all at the same time. I'm gonna wipe off most of the product from the beginning of the brush, kind of push it towards the end. And this is how much product you need. And I'm gonna apply a thin coat and I'm gonna take my time applying it very carefully. Because with the gel colors, if it's gonna cure, you will not be able to wipe off with a nail polish remover. If I do make a mistake, I like to take the cuticle pusher and just wipe off. And now I'm gonna cure for 45 seconds. Now I'm gonna apply a second coat. And the same thing, you have to be very careful that you don't put too much of a product on your nails. Cure. Now for the top coat, I'm gonna be using this LED gel top coat by Red Carpet. Again, I'm gonna try to clean most of the product off, leave very little bit on the brush and apply on my nails. And I'm gonna apply on the tip of my nail as well. And I'm gonna cure it. And our nails are done. The only thing left to do is to clean them from the sticky residue with the same purifier that we cleaned our nails in the first step. And I'm gonna be using a lint-free cloth and then you can just wipe your nails. And they are done. One thing I like to do after all my manicures is to apply some oil around my cuticles. I just have a random bottle of cuticle oil. I'm just gonna put a little bit on my cuticles to hydrate them and massage it into my cuticle. And that's it. My nails are done. This concludes my tutorial. List of all the products that I used for today's video will be linked down below for you guys easily to find. To get with all the information where you can follow me, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate. Like this tutorial if you liked it, if you would like to see more of them. Don't forget to click the notification bell so you get notified when I post my tutorials. And I think this should be it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!